Hello, this is Yumi. Today I'm going to write some kanji. So let's get started. Okay. Okay, today I'm going to write um, some kanji uh, for first graders uh, at elementary school. So, um, for first year, you know, first graders learn 80 kanji. <laughs> yes, in one year. So, and they are, how old are they? They are six years old and starting the, you know, uh, elementary school. And at first they learn hiragana, then katakana, and then kanji. They start learning kanji. So I'm going to show you how to write kanji. And at first, um, the orders uh, of for 80 kanji is uh, depending on the textbook and the Japanese textbook includes many stories and usually each story has the you know kanji used many kanji and then they will learn uh, little by little through the we call it kanji drill kanji drill the you know practice notebook for kanji and then um, so the orders are depending on that story, the textbook. And today I'm going to show you how to write. Um, it's, you know, I, I'd like to show you the things. Um, it's meaning the weather or the nature. Yes, uh, meanings. So nature or the you know the things for express uh, expressing the weather, for example. So uh, it's not IUL order, okay? So first of all, do you know this kanji? <laughs> Let's practice together. Can you can you see this is like this? Okay, so this is uh, called ki or ke. Ki or ke. Ke wa ni kakou kana? Where can I write ke? Or ke. Ke te kaite kou ka. Nakaten de ke. Ki or ke. Genki no ki ne. <laughs> you know genki? O genki desu ka? Ne, how are you? No toki no ki. Ki is atmosphere or the air <laughs> so ki jia donna kanji ga ikkana eto tenki yeah let's write tenki tenki wa ten is the word for in heaven right ten kone ki okay one, two, three, four, five, six. Six, roku. Nokaku ne. Koko no bubun wa kigamae te yon desu kedo. Kaite mas ka? Kigamae. Kore, koko no bubun wa ne. Koko no bubun dake wa. Koko wa ne. We call it this part. Ah, kigamae. Eto, koko ne. Ki. Ga. Ma. E. This part. We call it of this kanji. Okay. The tenki is this one. Weather. Okay. Tenki. Tenki. Okay. So the stroke, it depends on the stroke. You have to be careful how you write. The teachers will check this part, for example. Uh, if you did not do this, uh, teachers will give you a no good mark. <laughs> so, ne. Eto. Okay, how about next one? Just wait a minute. One, two, three, oops, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. This time, eight stroke. How do you call this kanji? Yes. Mm, there are three 
、uh, pronunciation for this. First one is U. Yeah, it's kind of a Chinese reading. And the other thing is like Japanese reading is Ame. Ame. Rain. It, it means rain. And other meanings is、uh, we say also depending on the next kanji, Ama. Ama is the, the third reading, okay, for this kanji. So, Ame is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay. It's kind of drops,、uh, raining, yeah, four drops. Then, Ame is Amamizu. So, ne, Ame is just rain, and Amamizu. Let's write Ama Mizu. Mizu, mizu.、Uh, mizu is water, so Ama is Ama Mizu no toki ni tsukaru ne. Ama Mizu. Kure Mizu ne. So, so, so. Ama Mizu te yu yi kata ga aru ne. The water of rain. Okay, the water of rain. Okay. Ja, tsugi itte miyo ka. Next one. Ten. Ten wa ne. 先ほど天,天気の天で出ましたからね。Yes, I did it ten, but I try again. I try it again. One, two. The next, you know, the second stroke is shorter than the first one. Then just keep it down from the first stroke. And then, h a l a u Shoot, h a l a u Now, this is ten. Ten k i no ten. Okay, the weather. Ten. Ten is the heaven or the. Thing. Also, this、uh, is other readings too. Ten or ama or ame. Ame is possible.、ね、so, so, so, so.、ね、so, how do you say? Ten. So, ne. Ten. Tatueba. Ten sight. ジニアスとかね。天才書いてみる。天。天。なんかすごい小さい。スモール。<笑>なんでだろう。天才はサイね。これはジニアス。or the the age you 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 can also use。これでえー、っと天さ。by the way、uh, if it's Chinese reading in the dictionary、uh, you know for that children's textbooks、uh,。It is written in katakana like this. It, it means Chinese characters, Chinese readings, okay? And when it's written in、uh, hiragana, it means kunyomi. Kunyomi is Japanese reading. So、uh, kanji has、um, many, because of that, we have many readings for one kanji. Ne. Wakaru. Ne. Ten. Aki wa ne. Chinese reading. Anyway, the ten wa o k a t a ne? You can write it. Okay. So, so, so. Eto, just one tip for this ten. Ten is ten key also,、uh, weather and ten sign genius. And also,、um, do you know this one? I just write it to you. <laughs> this is not, not really a, a spoken uh, language uh, vocabulary, but I just wanted to. Know this kanji too. You, you might see this yeah kanji, four kanji together like this way. Then we call it tenchi muyo. Tenchi muyo. Tenchi muyo. What is tenchi muyo? Yeah? This is, if it, it's new to you, it's good. So it means in Japanese, I will. Express it now. Tenchi muyo to wa ue to shita o sakasama ni shina yo ni. Nimots o tori gatska u toki no chu i no kotoba to shite hako ni harare tari shimas. Did you get it? Okay, I will explain that.、Uh, hako is box. This is not a hako, but if you see this eraser as a box, if it's written tenchi muyo here, And then it means if it's upside here, and then the other side is the, the down bottom, right? 
And then ten, if it's ten shimoyo on this box, you say, oh, you cannot turn it over. Okay, keep this way, please, for that for sale. For that, you know, because if you turn it over, then the, the inside, uh, you know, products might be broken. So, ten shimoyo is the uh, word. Uh, please. Uh, you know, uh, bring this parcel uh, safely and do not turn it over. No! <laughs> so, this is Tenchi Mayo. Did you get it? Okay, great! So, today you learned a very useful expression, and I hope you like this video. Please subscribe to this channel if not yet. <laughs> so, today you learned. Kitenki U Ame Ama Ama Nizu Ten Ame Ama Ame Ten Sai Ten Chimuyo. Okay? So, thank you for uh, watching and thank you for joining me and see you in the next video. <laughs> Arigatou gozaimashita. See you in the next video. Bye. Bye bye.